Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Noble Region Master. And like I said, we are going to be doing an opening, finally. I was talking about the Yu-Gi-Oh! Legendary Collection, and here it is. So I do have one more of these, and I'm going to be giving one away. Like I said, it's a thank you for sticking around with me so long. Um, I haven't decided how I'm going to do it yet. I think I have an idea. I have mentioned it in previous videos, but we don't know yet. And I honestly don't know what to pull from these boxes, because I haven't looked at the deck list. I just got it from my friend a few days ago. And he said, uh, yo, check these cards out. I'm not going to tell you what's in it. So I didn't. But I'm honestly hoping just by the description, we can get all three uh, legendary god cards. That would be awesome. Because those were beautiful back in the day. Like these ones, not the old disgusting ones where, you know, they had the weird messed up slifer. Ooh. So actually, they do give us all three god cards. That's going to be beautiful. Um... You know what, guys? I'm going to try and get my hands on another one. Actually, I don't know if I'm going to get Obelisk, Slifer, and Draw. We might just get Obelisk. And Obelisk, guys, you know, was portrayed as not the best, per se, in, uh, you know, in, um, in the video game and, uh, in anime, but in, uh, the, like, meaning the TV, meaning the TV show, but in anime, Obelisk is actually the best. So we got Obelisk, we got Slifer, we got Ra, we got that classic blue eyes white dragon with the stone tablet behind him. We got the emo dark magician and we got the emo red eyes black dragon. So not a bad haul overall. I would have liked to, you know, eh, I would have liked the classic dark magician, but I'm not going to argue with that. You know, free is free when we take those. We take those, boys. All right, next we got the legendary blue, uh, legend of blue eyes white dragon. So let's see what we can get from here. Guys, you know what actually I'm going to do? You guys like, you, if you if I get like three likes on this video, let's say, I will be doing this as a video idea. I will use classic cards like these. I will make a new Dueling Network account. And I will use, or I'll get one of my friends, and I will use these cards, like old cards, to win a duel. Because the, these, honestly guys, the old classic cards are the best because they don't have any crazy effects. There were no XYZ monsters. There were no Synchro monsters. It was just pure out classic card with monster attack so we got dark king of the best we got beast fangs which uh increases attack and defense by 300 points we got spike cedra never heard of that trial of nightmare i've heard of that Ooh, reaper of the cards let's see let's see i don't know if you guys will be able to read it or not but we'll go ahead and show it anyways uh it says flip select one trap card on the field and destroy it if the selected card is set pick up and see that card if it is a trap card, it is destroyed. If it's a spell card, return it to its original position. Now, guys, this actually isn't bad, but what the hell is with that 1380 attack? Like, which 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 brilliant guy at Konami was like, yo, guys, we got to make this Reaper of the Cards card. So it, we have to make it so it can destroy traps if it attacks. But it's so overpowered to be able to destroy traps that we can't give it 1400 attack or 1390. We have to give it specifically 1380 because it can destroy it, thir that 1379 monster, which is so overpowered. Come on, guys. Okay, we got Yami, the Darkness, you know, Witty Fathom. I remember that guy when he captured Kaiba and he was all, like, eccentric and gay, but whatever. Kaiba was gay. So, actually, I don't know if Kaiba's gay. There's a fan theory that he married a Shizu, which I highly doubt. But, okay, you know, we can give that to the fanfiction Wasteland and our mail. So, not bad. Um, if you guys see a card in here you want, let me know. The blue, you know, blue eyes and dark vision and... God cards are off limits, but um, anything else is all yours. So we got Island Turtle, Gift of the Mystical Elf, awesome. Dark Fire Soldier number two, Enchanted Javelin, Force Requisition. Now, guys, this actually card is actually really good. Um, you can activate, you know, you can discard from your hand. Remember, let's say for Dark Worlds, you discard a card from your hand. Uh, every time you discard, your opponent also has to discard the same cards. So it's actually really good for being meta, you know, back in the day. Harpy's Brothers, Time Seal, yep, your opponent skips their next draw phase. Bombardment Beetle, I haven't heard of this card. Flip, here, I'll, let me try and uh, angle my light a little bit over here so you guys can see it better. Uh, give me a second, guys. There we go, that should be a little bit better. Uh, it's, let's see. Flip. Select one face down defense mo position monster your opponent controls and look at it. If it's a face down effect monster, destroy it. 
and flip effects are not activated. If not, return a face on No, guys, this isn't a bad card either, which is why I like some of the old classic cards from Yu-Gi-Oh! Because, you know, while they were very simple, some of them had crazy good effects that, you know, people underestimated and undervalued a lot. Which is why I don't I don't get that. And we got a uh, minor goblin official. You can only activate this card when your opponent's life points are 3,000 or less and flip 500 damage to your opponent's life points during... Ooh! We're going to try using this card uh, in a burn deck, okay guys? Remind me of that if I forget. 20 packs. We opened 2 packs. We got 3 more. 4 more. And... Ooh! Guys, look at this. I like this new map. Yo, this is so sick. Bro. Guys, so you got your Slifer, you got your Emo Dark Magician, you got your Blue Eyes, your Emo Dark Magician, Angry Obelisk the Tormentor, Black Exodia, Magician of Black Chaos. Man, Yuki really loves black, don't they? Meteor, Dra Black Meteor Dragon and the Wind Dragon of Raw or Mega Ultra Chicken. And in the back, you got... Let's keep that there. Yeah, you got Angry Yugi, or Cocky Joy, or whatever. Actually, you know what? We can, we can, we'll, we'll, we'll do it in the next opening for Return of the Bling. We got Joey, Kaiba, and Yugi. All right, now let's pick it back to the opening, guys. All right, we got Twin Sword, Cell Reproduction, Guardian. I'm out. Guys, I really want to make... Um, uh, Raphael deck because his deck was so good and it was like honestly one of the people who beat Yu-Gi-Oh Like you know like broke Yu-Gi-Oh records for you know for people watching that show was you know the fact that um, Raphael was able to beat um, Yami or Yugi or Tem, whatever you want to call him and I find it funny that they decided to name him Raphael I'm just saying uh, Misfit of the Infernal General Checkmate Tribute one Archfiend monster on your side of the field during this turn. One Tarot King Archfiend on your, on your side of the field can attack your opponent's life wings directly. Yo, that sounds like an awesome card and very situational though. But honestly, that doesn't seem like that bad. Like, I'll try using... I'll, you know what, guys? I'll build an Archfiend deck as well. Ojama Trio, Maju Gazret. Awesome card. Uh, tribute any two monsters and their attack is... This card's attack is a sum of theirs, so you could tribute like... Uh, Dark Magician and Blue Eyes, and it would have 5,500 attack, which isn't that bad, and Arch King's Roar. So overall, guys, it's not a bad haul. Um, like I said, let me know if any cards you guys see in here that you want, except, you know, these cards in the corner over here, and they will be yours. Uh, what else? I, you know, I really don't get how Asian Eyes has the trouble opening these. Yo, I had one of these fake cards back in the day, like, my dad would get these cards from China, and I was like eight, and I'd be really happy. But, you know, in China, you know, a lot of stuff is really cheap because it's not, you know, the best quality or it's not, you know, real. It's done very well, but it's fake. So I'm really happy to see this card. You know, when you have Ojama green, Ojama yellow, and Ojama black. On, why do they love black so much? Anyways, you can destroy all cards in the field. Hyper Hammerhead, Big Koala, Soul Absorption, Mad Dog of the Darkness, Zero Gravity, Desk Kangaroo, loved this card. Inferno Skulls and Pinch Hopper, Weevil's favorite card. Yo, we got like some sort of goat ram. Ancient One of the Deep Forest, October Sir. For a second, I thought that said Oktoberfest. And you know, what's funny is Oktoberfest takes place in September, for those of you who don't know. Weather Report, Dark Zebra, Senju, Curse of the Fiend, Crab Turtle, so overpowered back in the days, guys. Raising Air Current and Flash Assailant. I remember would get a power-up boost in um, Yu-Gi-Oh! video games because they had uh, field advantages and like dark monsters countered like uh, certain other cards and light counter light monsters counter dark. So like I could have um, a 200 attack monster and destroy this just because of the archetypes they counter each other. Leg Ghoul, Tear the Pain, Leo Gun. I loved Leo Gun. I had this card in my Yu-Gi-Oh! game. Feral Imp, Shield and Sword. Catapult Turtle, which Yugi used to sacrifice Dark Magician Girl, Rip, Prevent Rat, Roaring Ocean Snake, and Pumpkin the King of Ghosts. 
And I think that's it, guys. I think we're all out of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So overall, not a bad haul. Very some are you know very good cards, some are the old classics. But overall, it was good haul. Like I said, I will be giving one of these away. Um, very happy that I was able to get these three beauties, though. Um, you know, considering the fact that, well, I thought they would only give one because Konami does like to be cheap sometimes. But look at that beauty. Obelisk, the Tormentor, Slifer, the Executive Producer, and the and Mega Ultra Chicken, Blue Eyes White Dragon, Emo Dark Magician, and Emo Red Eyes. Um, but that's it for this video, guys. Like I said, I'll be doing a giveaway of Return of the Bling and um, the Legendary Collection. But um, drop a like, guys. Uh, drop your name if you want me to put you in the random name generator so you guys can have it. And until next time, guys, it's your boy Novel Reach Master.